bass, but that's a song, amen, that is based on the word of God. And speak over yourself, encourage yourself in the Lord. Hallelujah. And who knows that, amen, Brother Terrell talked about Brother Matt having a spirit to encourage and to exhort. I mean, I wish I could just get, amen, just a handful of people just to go and just find someone. And just go and find someone and just speak a word of encouragement over somebody. Come on, if you can just find just one person, amen, somewhere in the building, amen, and take turns just speaking an encouraging word of life into somebody. And then exchange encouraging words. And if someone encourages someone, and that person encourages the next person, just encourage somebody. Get up at it, see if you can. Go and find somebody. Just hug somebody. Shake someone's hand. Just release an encouraging word of inspiration. Release an encouraging, inspiring word of love. Just encourage somebody today. And then just love on somebody. Grab somebody and inspire someone to run this good to fight this good fight, to run this race, amen, with encouragement, to run this race, amen, not discouraged, but with belief that we shall be and we are victorious. Hallelujah. When you encourage somebody who can have enough encouragement in your spirit, go and find somebody else and encourage somebody and inspire someone to hold on to God's unchanging hand. Amen. For the word can heal, shall heal. The word can change, will change. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Come on, encourage somebody. Encourage somebody. When it's almost over, I know it's hard to encourage someone when you're going through, when you have problems. But if you try to find it deep in your spirit, a belief in them, that you tell someone that the Spirit of God will turn and tell the truth. Thank you, Jesus. Come on, find one more person. Saying you encourage one another, it encouraged me, amen, on today to, amen, release this word and just to encourage not just our youth and young adults, but even our adults has been, amen, a, a, a long day already. We, uh, those that were able to make it, amen, a very uh, inspirational service. We just left a uh, celebration of life service for uh, 
the very renowned uh, Elder Min Yong Snipes, amen, uh, a very beloved woman of God, amen, uh, a woman of God that's going to be missed, amen, in the body of Christ and amongst loved ones, but uh, the display of love, amen, it was uh, very heartfelt, it was touching, um, an overflow of uh, saints that came pouring in, amen, just to simply show their face and to give due respect, amen, to her mother and father that I know is going to miss her dearly. But the word that was released and the power that was released was to encourage the living. Come on, I wish I had a witness in this house, amen. When you attend a service like that, amen, you, you encourage and you're blessed and thankful to still be in the land of the living. And then to say that I thank God that he spared my life one more day. And then I want to thank God, amen, that though the deceased has passed, that God has inspired me to run this race and to continue to fight this good fight of faith until I receive and you receive your crown of righteousness, amen. Oh, uh, what a day, what a day, what a day. Man, the songwriter said, amen, what a time, what a time, what a time. Amen. Yes, hey, you can fill in the blanks what type of time you believe you're going to have in glory. Yes, but yes. Hey, man, when I think about the goodness of Jesus, when I think about how Christ already said, I have went away, amen, to prepare a mansion for you. Amen. I can think about my residence, and I can imagine, amen, my place Amen. In glory. Sitting at the feet of the master. Amen. Just worshiping and crying out, holy, 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 Lord God Almighty. Amen. That, that, that's for another day. But for this day, amen, we need, we need a word of encouragement that's going to help us to get from this day, amen, until tomorrow. Amen. 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 But we bless God for everyone that came today. Amen. Brother Terrell did an excellent job. Amen. 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 Bless God. Amen. amen. For the man of God that has been raised up amen, to do great things in the kingdom and for all of the testimonies that inspired me. Amen. Sister Michelle. and. And, uh, you know, just say, man, continue to allow God to use you for his glory. Whatever it may be, and we're going to rejoice with you. We're going to weep with you. Amen. But most importantly, we're going to also conquer and overcome with you. Amen. 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 I, I truly, I mean, you, you said and you spoke up here that you are trying to develop into uh, a mature woman of God. But I can tell you that I see you blossoming like a flower Amen. right before our very eyes. Amen. Amen. And I thank God for it. She, she's the youngest of the bunch. Amen. I'm the young adult. So she needs, amen, our encouragement. She needs y'all's encouragement so that she can, amen, reach that place of not just prosperity, but that place of uh, sanctification and that place of prestige where one day we can truly say that the last has become the first. Come on, can the weak say I'm strong on today? Amen. Hallelujah. Let's put our hands together and bless. Amen. The Spirit of the Living God is one more time. I will come to the and then in His blessed sanctuary. Amen. For Brother Matt, I thank you for the word I shared with him. Just a very tip. I told him uh, I wasn't the scheduled speaker for the day, so I said, I just say, man, just came forth just to um, inspire the saints, to encourage the saints, just to give them uh, 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 hope. Amen. To continue to live this life. And and to, to, to be atmosphere changers, to, to change and to impact everywhere they go, every person they come encounter with, to impact, amen, every job, every residence, just by them being in the atmosphere. And I believe as we get more atmosphere changers in the body of Christ, we can begin to put more demons in the flight. Amen. Amen. As we get more, more consecrated, prayed up saints that are entering certain atmospheres where needed, amen, we can begin to uh, clear some of the corners and we can begin to change some of our families and we can begin to change those that we're coming in contact with, as you said, Brother Matt, so profoundly, just by being who we was called to be in Christ Jesus. Amen. Just by someone reading the very script. Amen. Of who God made you. And God made. God said that we are fearfully and wonderfully made. And I don't know about you. Amen. But I, I believe the word when it says that I was made in his image. 
and in his likeness. Amen. Amen. I believe that. Amen. I've been called and you've been called to be to be a child of God. Not just a child of God, but to make a change, not because of who we are, but simply by applying the word. Amen. 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 But we're not going to be before you long. We had we had a, a lot of announcements. Please govern yourselves according to the announcements. I'm going to ask the ministers and the youth and young adults to stay behind uh, for a few minutes after service so we can uh, game plan and uh, confirm some changes for tomorrow and how we're going to conduct ourselves. Spread the word for those that are missing. It's a very important service, not just for what we've been planning. There's been a few changes along the way which will inform the uh, soldiers on the battlefield, the youth and young adults, what's in store. But um, as the repairs of the breach come, come down and the... Um, the head of the repairs of the breach, uh, Bishop Roosevelt Johnson, uh, he was just so inspired by uh, the fellowship that we had up in um, Messiah. He was going to allow the ministers to take a rotation, amen, to come around and speak from house to house. But he said it was such a blessing up here. I'm led to come down to release the word myself amen. down there in uh, Wilmington, Delaware. So I'm truly looking forward to it. Let's not just uh, meet, him, meet them here. Let's beat them here in the house. Yeah. I mean, I believe that the word is going to be powerful. The uh, song ministry is going to be blessed as the choir comes forth, amen, to sing songs, hymns, and spiritual songs tomorrow. Uh, we'll put together our own selection to come forth to bless the house where we believe in God for, amen, a, a surge and a, a power-packed service tomorrow, an anointed service when all the saints of God come marching in, amen? amen. So that service is slated for 4 o'clock, and our intention is to beat them here at the house, that when they walk into the atmosphere, they walk into the atmosphere that is charged with power and praise. Amen? Amen. 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 But uh, we're going to go to the further parts of the service before we bow our heads in prayer. Amen. On this uh, blessed youth and young adult day, we want to uh, bless, as always, and take the time to let them know that we love them, we appreciate them. We always want to uh, bless the uh, Wonderful ministerial staff we have, amen, our uh, Pastor Harris, and amen, amen our Minister Judy, and amen. Lady Harris, Lady Jeremy, amen, Evangelist amen. Morgan, amen. and uh, Evangelist Edna in her absence, amen, and all the saints of the Most High God, amen, we thank each one of you, amen, our fantastic drummer, amen, and his uh, fiance, amen, Sister Alicia, Pop Brew, uh, everyone, amen, our, our, our master, Amen. I, I, a master recorder, amen, that has been recording uh, messages in the spirit of excellence from the Martinez. And it, it, it's been steady. It's been it's been profound. It's been something that we can we can produce and that those can look on the internet and say, wow, that is a, a job that was uh, done in the spirit truly of excellence. Brother Gary um, inspired me and, and confirmed that the Facebook account is set up. He's just waiting for the right pick to take. And um, I told you you should have seen her face. I said, don't don't uh, hit the send button until she gets a chance to view the profile. If you can see the look I got and how the eyebrows literally touched the right and the left, met right in the middle, and, um, you, you would have said, okay, I see why uh, Big Cuz said that. But um, I told him, hold, I said, hold, hold off until she gets a chance to view the profile and make sure everything's set. Those that have friends, Brother Gary's going to communicate with you for those that are already friends of yours, that we, what churches and uh, what individuals that we want to send friend requests to, but there'll be a, a strategic process on how we're going to get this set up. And the other thing that the ministers have been working on, it's almost time for this thing to launch. Just everything, the fellowship, and then the power, the growth, the information that's about to be spread abroad. Amen. We are very close and nigh to a, a breakthrough and then to a change for what we've been waiting for for a long time. And all I can do, I'm just silly enough, I don't know about you, to believe God. And then, then it's not too far away. I'm believing God there is a change coming. I'm believing God, amen, that saints are going to get saved. I'm believing God that he's going to fill the house. I'm believing God that there's going to be elevation and increase. I'm believing God that, amen, the saints as a whole are going to be set free and delivered by the power of the living God. I'm believing that God's going to meet every need. I'm believing that where there's been torture, pain, and suffering, that God's going to grant peace in the midst of what you're going through. I believe that where there's been sadness and depression, that God...